Hi, this is Dr. Rajeshwar from YR Pharma Tube. Previously, we discussed the male and female sex hormones, the drugs used for erectile dysfunction, oral contraceptives, and corticosteroids. You can find the links below this video in the description. Watch them. In today's lesson, I would like to discuss thyroid drugs such as levothyroxine and levothyronine. In this lesson, you will learn to identify the different hormones produced by the thyroid gland, to discuss the thyroid hormone deficiency disorders, chemistry, mechanism of action, medicinal uses, and individual drugs such as levothyroxine and levothyronine. Introduction to Thyroid Drugs The thyroid is quite a large gland weighing about 20 grams in adults situated in the neck in front of the trachea. In shape, the thyroid consists of two lobes and looks like a butterfly. This thyroid gland secretes two types of hormones which are fundamentally different. One type includes the hormones thyroxine and triiodothyronine which are necessary for normal growth and development, body temperature and energy levels. They affect every organ system and have a crucial role in metabolic processes, including those involved in the synthesis and degradation of essentially all other hormones. Iodine is an essential element for the manufacture of both of these hormones. These hormones contain 59% and 65% respectively of iodine as an essential part of the molecule. The other type of endogenous hormone is calcitonin secreted by the C cells of the thyroid and it is important in the regulation of calcium metabolism. The activity of thyroid gland is regulated by thyroid stimulating hormone produced by the anterior pituitary gland. When the level of circulating thyroid hormones decreases, the anterior pituitary secretes thyroid stimulating hormone which then activates the cells of the thyroid to release stored thyroid hormones. This is an example of the feedback mechanism. Thyroid stimulating hormone is the prime regulator of iodine uptake and thyroid hormone formation by the thyroid gland. Diseases associated with both inadequate production and reproduction of thyroid hormones are hypothyroidism and hyperthyroidism respectively. Hypothyroidism is a condition in which the thyroid gland does not capable of producing enough of thyroid hormones. Two well-known examples include iodine deficiency and primary thyroid disease. In case of iodine deficiency, the thyroid becomes inordinately large and is called a goiter. The most severe and devastating form of hypothyroidism is seen in young children with congenital thyroid deficiency. Hyperthyroidism results from over-secretion of thyroid hormones. Hyperthyroidism can accelerate the body's metabolism, causing unintentional weight loss and a rapid or irregular heartbeat. Drugs used for treating hyperthyroidism are called antithyroid drugs. Chemistry of Thyroid Hormones The structural formulas of thyroxine and triiodothyronine as well as reverse triiodothyronine are shown here. All of these naturally occurring molecules are levoisomers. All these hormones are the iodine containing amino acid derivatives of thyronine. In other words, they are the derivatives of tyrosine bound covalently to iodine. See the structure of tyrosine and amino acid. Iodine is essential for the manufacturing of these hormones. The thyroid hormones are basically two tyrosines linked together with the critical addition of iodine at three or five positions on the aromatic rings. The number and position of the iodines is important. Thyroxine contains four atoms of iodine and is thus called T4. Triiodothyronine contains three atoms of iodine and is called T3. T3 and T4 each contains two phenyl rings linked by ether bridge. Several other iodinated molecules are generated that have little or no biological activity so called reverse T3 is such an example. These hormones are poorly soluble in water and more than 99% of the T3 and T4 circulating in blood is bound to carrier proteins. Excess thyroxine causes hyperthyroidism with increased heart rate, blood pressure, overactivity, muscular weakness and loss of weight. 
compared with thyroxine triiodothyronine is more potent and has a more rapid onset and shorter duration of action despite the minor differences these two hormones produce the same physiological effects and have the same actions and uses thyroid drugs can be natural or synthetic hormones they may contain t3 t4 or both natural thyroid drugs are made from animal thyroid Synthetic thyroid drugs are actually the sodium salts of L isomers of the hormones. Peripheral metabolism of thyroxine. The primary pathway for the peripheral metabolism of thyroxine is deiodination by three 5-D iodinase enzymes that is D1, D2 and D3. Deiodination of T4 may occur by mono deiodination of the outer ring producing 3,5,3- triiodothyronine that is T3 which is 3 to 4 times more potent than T4. The D1 enzyme is responsible for about 24% of the circulating C3 while 64% of peripheral T3 is generated by D2 which also regulates T3 levels in the brain and pituitary. D3 iodination produces metabolically inactive that is 3,3-5-triiodothyronine that is reverse T3. The low serum levels of T3 and reverse T3 in normal individuals are due to the high metabolic clearances of these two compounds. Drugs such as amiodarone, iodinated contrast media, beta blockers and corticosteroids as well as severe illness or starvation inhibit the 5-D-iodinase necessary for the conversion of T4 to T3 resulting in low T3 and high reverse T3 levels in the serum. A polymorphism in the D2 gene can reduce T3 activation and impair thyroid hormone response. Mechanism of action of thyroid hormones is similar to that of steroid hormones. T4 that is thyroxine needs to be converted into T3 inside the cell for binding to thyroid receptor. Thyroid hormones are used in the treatment or prevention of hypothyroidism caused by subacute or chronic thyroiditis, hormone supplement after hyperthyroid treatment, euthyroid goiter that is enlargement of a normal thyroid gland, thyroid nodules and multinodular goiter, some types of depression and thyroid cancer. Coming to the individual drugs, levothyroxine. Levothyroxine is also known as L-thyroxine. It is manufactured from the thyroid gland and contains 4 atoms of iodine and is called T4. It is chemically L344-hydroxy, 3-5-diiodophenoxy, 3,5-diiodophenyl alanine. Levothyroxine is synthesized in a multi-stage synthesis from 4-hydroxy-3-iodo-5-nitrobenzaldehyde. Reacting this with benzene sulfonyl chloride in pyridine giving the corresponding benzene sulfonate. The benzene sulfonyl group of which is easily replaced with a 4-methoxyphenyloxy group upon reaction with 4-methoxyphenol. The resulting 3-iodo-4-4-methoxyphenoxy-5-nitrobenzaldehyde is reacted further with N-acetylglycine in the presence of sodium acetate in which the resulting yalidine compound cyclizes to an oxazolone derivative. The oxazolone ring of this compound is opened upon reaction with sodium methoxide forming the desired cinnamic acid derivative. The nitro group of this compound is reduced to an amino group by hydrogen in the presence of Rani nickel catalyst forming the corresponding amine and subsequent diazotization and replacement of the diazo group of which with iodine gives the methyl ester of alpha acetamido 3,5-diiodo 4,4-methoxyphenoxy crotonic acid. The resulting compound undergoes a simultaneous reaction with hydrogen iodide and phosphorus in acetic acid in which the double bond in the crotonic acid is reduced and the methoxy protection is removed from the phenol ring. During this, a simultaneous hydrolysis of the acetyl group on the nitrogen atom also takes place forming a mixture of DL35-diiodothyronine. 
The amino group in this product is once again protected by the reaction with the formic acid in the presence of acetic anhydride which gives D and L isomers of N-formyl 3,5-diiodothyronine. Separation of isomers in the resulting racemic mixture is accomplished using brucine giving dextro and levo isomers of 3,5-diiodothyronines. The protecting formyl group is hydrolyzed using hydrobromic acid giving levo 3,5-diiodothyronine which undergoes direct iodination using iodine in the presence of potassium iodide in aqueous methylamine to give the desired levothyroxine. Levothyroxine is used to treat thyroid hormone deficiency including the severe form known as mixed edema coma. It may also be used to treat and prevent certain types of thyroid tumors. It is not indicated for weight loss. It is taken by mouth or given by injection into a vein. The next drug is levothyronine. Levothyronine is also known as L-thyronine or T3 is a thyroid hormone. It affects almost every physiological process in the body including growth and development, metabolism, body temperature and heart rate. It is a true hormone. Its effects on target tissues are about 4 times more potent than those of T4. Of the thyroid hormone that is produced, just about 20% is T3 whereas 80% is produced as T4. Roughly 85% of the circulating T3 is later formed in the liver and anterior pituitary by removal of the iodine atom from the carbon atom number 5 of the outer ring of T4. In any case, the concentration of T3 in the human blood plasma is about 1 by 40th that of T4. It is chemically L344-hydroxy-3-iodophenoxy-3,5-diiodophenylalanine. Synthesis of levothyronine or T3 T3 is more metabolically active hormone produced from T4. T4 is deiodinated by three deiodinase enzymes to produce the more active triiodothyronine that is a T3 during which an iodine atom at the outer ring is eliminated. This reaction is known as deiodination reaction. Synthesis of reverse T3 on the right and T2 middle down are also shown. T3 is used in the treatment of depressive disorders and as a fat loss supplement. It has been used to treat Wilson's syndrome, an alternative medical diagnosis not recognized as a medical condition by mainstream medicine. This is the list of references followed. That's all in this lesson, thyroid drugs such as levothyroxine and levothyronine. In the next lesson, we discuss the anti-thyroid drugs. Till then, never stop learning and never stop watching my videos. Thank you for watching this video.